Hello, my name is Jonas Monopteris. I'm with Horizon Productions, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to set up a local Nucleus server on a local network. In my case, it's for my office. That enables us to be able to use Omniverse Create, have the same level and be able to interact for multiple computers. So first thing you want to do, of course, is to install both Create Beta and Cache. And on the computer that you want to be the Nucleus server, create a um, Nucleus. So you have your local host where you have your files and you have your level. Once you already have that, you're going to want to go to localhost 3080 and enable sharing here. By default, this is disabled. So you want to enable that and that's your first step. And instead of going to localhost 8080, go to your IP address, colon 8080. And this allows the invite links that you send out to be specified to your computer. So it works correctly. So you'll want to create a user. And once this user has been created, click on them. In this case, I'm clicking on Simone, invite user. Once they've accepted and they have everything set up on their end and having create, etc., you both should be able now to log in and launch create and see the folders that were set up. For me, since I'm on this computer, I'm already going to have this local host with all the folders that are created because these are all just local to my machine. However, the other person is not going to be able to see that. What they're going to have to do is add new connection. And right here, they're going to just enter that IP address that was in the invite link, which is my computer's IP address. Once they enter that, they should be able to see this as a folder down here and be able to navigate to the folders. I'm going to open up a level. It's just a test level. And once I'm inside, on the top right, it says live sync is turned off. We want to turn that on so we're seeing the live changes. So if we go over to layer, the cloud icon, we can toggle this on. So now any changes that I do is going to be replicated over the network. And that is everything. Thank you for watching, and I hope this video was useful for you.